On the first day, we started our journey from Pekara and reached Jongsam in Mustang. The next morning we left Jongsam for Kerala border. This high mountainous desert with a different topography was becoming a very new experience for us. Despite the difficult geographical location, a gravel road has been constructed up to the Kerala border and is in the process of being tarred. On the way to Kerala Pass, which is made up of high mountains, you can see deserts, mountains and few small settlements. Inside the walled villages, mud-walled and roofed houses could be seen. Korala Pass is a mountain pass between Tibet and Upper Mustang.
The colorful high heels looked very marvelous, as if the most talented artists carved them. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Pakistan and Afghanistan border. I am in Pakistan and Afghanistan. I am in Pakistan Pakistan. I am in Afghanistan. I am in Afghanistan. I am in At only 4,660 meters in elevation, it has been considered the lowest drivable path between Tibet and Nepal. It is currently being planned as a vehicle border crossing between China and Nepal. Due to the high mountainous terrain, it was very difficult for vehicles to pick up on the hill. Koralar is one of the oldest routes between the two regions. It was historically used for salt trade between Tibet and Nepal. Somewhere along the mountain walls, many ancient caves could be seen. The 
गोहेल माछाको सेपमा रहेछ त पुरे Until 2008 Upper Mustang was the Kingdom of Lo, an ethnic Tibetan kingdom, that was a suzerainty of Kingdom of Nepal. The suzerainty allowed for a certain level of independence and local governance from the Nepalese central government. During the late 1950s and 60s, the Tibetan guerrilla group Chushi Gangdrik operated out of Upper Mustang with the intention of raiding Pla positions in Tibet. This led to a border incident that caused the killing of a Nepalese officer who was mistaken by Chinese border guards as a Tibetan rebel. China and Kingdom of Nepal officially signed border agreement in 1961. <laughs> In December 1999, the 17th claimant Karmapa fled Tibet through this area. In response, China built a border fence immediately after. The border has been closed since the 1960s. However, there is a semi-annual cross-border trade fair during which the border is open to local traders. In 2012, Nepal and China agreed to open six more official border crossings, Korala being one of them. Nepal got 24 number pillar. 